good morning or almost afternoon um i just woke up and i'm trying to get myself together because i got a couple things that i need to do today and i decided i'm gonna vlog but i'm about to get ready real quick hopefully it's real quick so y'all can watch while i get ready So it's 12:24. I got dressed. I put on something like just a sweatshirt and some like yoga pants because I'm probably gonna try clothes on later. But I'm running late, so I'm not gonna record me eating because the lyrics are probably waiting on me right now. And then I'm gonna be back. So right now I'm at Gravely. I think that's how you pronounce it, Gravely Park. You probably could find it on TikTok. It's basically right near the airport. I think DCA Airport. And then you can like see like the airplanes come in and it's like super close and it's super cool because you don't realize how fast airplanes are going while they're landing until like you're outside. But I um came here because I have to do a reading assignment for my class, my research class. So I brought my textbook and I was like, why not go and read and watch airplanes? Because who wouldn't want to do that? And I was able to finally set up my little um another plane's about to come in and it's a lot of birds because it's about a water but anyways i was able to set up my little camera car mount thing unfortunately i couldn't put it on my dashboard because my car is so small in the front for some reason but i was able to like stick it on to like where my radio is i've been wanting a car mount so i could like record and stuff when i'm like driving or whatnot of course being safe but yeah so i'm about to read and watch airplanes and i get to see everybody with their little dogs which is super cute and it's a lot more crowded than i was expecting it to be like just in like the parking lot area i might get out and walk for a little bit um after i read uh what time is it where's my phone oh, right here um, so I got two chapters to read. I'm gonna try to leave here around 3.30ish. Um, because I still have to go to like Harris Teeter, maybe Walmart. And then get ready for a birthday party. So. to Target, my favorite store. I was going to go to Harris Teeter or Walmart, but the closest one was in DC, and I'm not trying to drive in DC right now, and it's four o'clock, so no. Um, so I decided to go to Target, and I need to get a bottle of wine and something pink to wear for tonight, because the girl whose party I'm going to, she's doing like this pink themed birthday party. Don't get me wrong, I don't dislike pink. I just don't like wearing pink like I have a lot of pink stuff in my room because I actually do like the color but it's just me and pink I don't know if we like go well together so we're about to see I got a couple more minutes of driving and then I'll be there I hate driving here like it's just so complicated for no reason and I honestly don't understand why like this is the second exit I missed and it added like three extra minutes it's whatever it's all right I, i'm not in a rush you know i'm trying to get out of the habit of feeling rushed and rushing myself when it comes to going places and doing things so it's okay i have time i might miss another exit i wouldn't be surprised if i did but we're getting there we are getting there Target like 
like 20 minutes ago. Jesus. This is my favorite Target to go to because it's so close to um, where I stay. And I love it. Oh, I can't reach that. That's shit. Oh, gosh. So discombobulated. <sighs> Story of my life. Chaotic. So chaotic. All right, let's go. Let's go. to buy those pink pants because I thought they were so cute and the material was like that thin like silky like breathable material but for some reason I don't know whose bright idea it was to put a layer of shorts on the inside so it created like that line I didn't like that I didn't like that like at all so I ended up just getting like a pink version of like the white shirt that I had on and I have these pants that I actually bought from Target that I haven't worn yet. And I bought them months ago. And I think I might put them on. Only if it looks right. But I was so disappointed because those pink pants were so cute. So cute. I've seen the vision. I've seen it. But it's okay. I'll just find something else to wear. Whatever. It's okay. <sighs> I'm running late again. Um, since my eyebrows aren't done, I'm not gonna do like a full face of makeup. I'm just about to do like a quick boom, 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 one, two, three. Oh, and I meant to say earlier, if y'all were wondering like why my face looked like it was like bruised, it's because I have this face suction thing that I bought the other day and I used it and it basically just like sucks like all the oil and blackheads and stuff out of your face. And the suction is real, like, it's real, that's how I got these marks. But they should go away. And it shouldn't happen the next time I use it. But yeah, we're gonna cover it up. I also don't really know what I'm wearing. Um, I pulled some stuff out. I found these really cute earrings that I wanna put on. Cause I don't hardly ever wear the earrings that I have anymore. And I was like, why not wear them? You never wear them. So let's wear them. So I'm trying to base my outfit off of them, but it's not its not really looking too good. It's not looking all that great. But right now, so far, I just have blue jeans with a pink shirt and these ruffle-like earrings. I don't really know how to explain them. Y'all will see them when I, when I finish. My eyebrows look terrible. Jesus. It's okay. I'll probably nair them tomorrow. I just don't have time to do it right now. And I also am just gonna say this, I am not a makeup artist. So please, 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 please don't talk about me. Cause I don't do makeup, I do art. I guess this is a form of art, but not this type of art. I really don't be knowing what I'm doing half the time, it just turns out good.
these are the earrings that I was talking about that I had for forever and never wore outside in public. And I think they're so cute. Like, look at that. Look at that. I think I'm gonna wear them. And one of my New Year's resolutions was to actually wear more color because I can pretty much just wear black and gray all day every day but I think I think I'm gonna wear them I honestly don't even remember where I got these from I think I had these got these when I was in high school from one of my teachers that's how long I've had them and have not wore them yet but this is a pink shirt keeping my sports bra on I don't have a necklace that will kind of go with the earrings I feel like because the earrings are like big and bright I don't think I need like a necklace or anything Okay, yeah, I think I'm good. I'm gonna wear the earrings. I'm probably gonna put my jean jacket on because I have on these um, tan pants that I'm about to show y'all in a second. And I'm probably gonna put on my red toms so they kind of match like the earrings to do like a pink and red vibe. Um, I think it'll be all right. I honestly don't have anything else, so. I'm probably going to wear this. Cause I don't, I don't know how to really dress for Look at this. Doritos in my coat pocket. Pink shirt, tan little yoga, stretch pants, my red toms, and then the earrings, which I think are really cute. I don't think I'm gonna carry a bag. I think I'm just gonna take um, my little shoulder bag and call it a day and go from there. <laughs> this morning um today is now sunday i was my mom's about to say saturday and 
I've been up for a little while already. It's one o'clock. I think I gotta go around like 11. So like I literally just finished eating. But yesterday was so much fun. I really enjoyed myself and being around people and like having fun has just continued to show me that like as an adult, like it's important that you still try to build like those friendships that you have and that you possibly could have. And I'm, I'm very glad that I went. I was very excited when I got the invitation. And a lot of those people that you've probably seen in the video are a part of the same graduate program that I'm in. It was fun and hopefully I will be hanging out with some of them again soon. Um, but yeah, I just think it's really important that as an adult, like especially as an emerging adult, that you take the time to spend time with others because I made that one of my goals actually to like go out more and I don't care what people say they always say like oh like all you have to do is go out and you'll meet people like that's not true because every time I go out if I go out by myself I'm probably somewhere sitting on the side in the corner by myself minding my business like it's not like how they display it in the movies like if you go out and you bump into somebody on accident and they're like oh hey like what's your name like that's not how that goes you know what I mean so I made it a goal to be more proactive when it comes to going out and hanging out and talking to people and like checking up on people um but yeah that's that Oh, and also, even though I kind of woke up late and I'm low-key getting my day started a little later than usual, um, I might be teaching my first art class solo by myself. <laughs> Kudos to me. Okay. Um, I'm excited. I don't really know what it's going to look like. I know I have to be at work at 4.30 and it's already 1.00. So I'll probably start getting ready around like 3.30. But the theme is Frozen and I'm probably gonna teach this class weekly if possible, like every Sunday, I think, which I'm not opposed to. Um, I like the movie Frozen, so I'll definitely record my prepping. But yeah, that's it. I'm probably about to do some homework and Oh yeah, I got a new lamp. Shout out to Marcy. She gave it to me. It's really cute. Um, I love it. It's it's just so cute. I had to move my bookshelf from right there and put it over there. Because um, I didn't know where else to put this lamp. Because I have another lamp in that corner. And I don't know where to put that one. So I left it there and I put that one right there. It's so cute. But yeah, I have homework to do. So I'm about to do that. Yay. I found out what the directive for today is. Well, not directive. The lesson for today is. And it is a Olaf themed. I don't know why I keep wanting to say directive. I'm going to work, not school. It's an Olaf themed lesson that is got something to do with like clay or whatnot. So I have to go prep that. I am a little bit nervous because I don't know how many kids are coming to this evening's session. I'm hoping it's not more than like six. I think I'll do good though. I always do good with everything that I do. And that's just that. But I also didn't record like getting ready because again, I was rushing. Also, when I get dressed like to go to work, I dress very comfortable. So like right now I only have on like a black long sleeve shirt, a like cardigan sweater with a scarf and I got on my Crocs with some yoga pants. And I only dress like that only because like if something gets messy, then it's not like really important, whatever I'm wearing. And also I have to wear an apron, which helps also. But that's pretty much it. That's why I like this job. It's like I can dress comfortably. I don't have to like dress like a teacher or whatnot. So I'm probably gonna do more vlogs. Um, it's just hard because being a student, like school like consumes my life. So like I might do like come to school with me or something like that. I don't know yet, but we'll see. We'll see. So all you can do is just wait and see.
okay um it is almost 10 p.m i've got back here i think around like 8 30 and i took a shower i washed my clothes and now i'm finally eating my sushi i've been wanting this sushi all weekend and i finally went and got it but yeah just to recap my day the lesson that i taught went really well there were three girls that came and the directive was really easy straightforward straight to the point whatever um they actually did a lot better than i did if we're being honest but yeah if you made it this far again i appreciate you because my own daddy don't even be watching my videos i have to force him to but anyways um that's about it and that's all i did this weekend i don't really have nothing else to do besides a little bit of more homework before i go to sleep but i need time to wind down and eat and watch tv so that's what i'm gonna do self-care comes first before anything remember that but yeah that's about it and i will see y'all next time next time hopefully i'll try to post a video <laughs>